welcome friends uh, today I would like to create this cute little canvas board um, actually just to try out those acrylic mousse mousse <laughs> acrylic mousse actually it's a very lightweight um, colored texture paste by a German brand called Marabou and uh, Thomas brought them home <laughs> from uh, the supermarket <laughs> today um, because they can, sometimes they have like weekly offers and um, sometimes they have like art and craft supplies and actually he went shopping for some food and he brought some home with him uh, because he thought I might like <laughs> to try them out and yeah I love that <laughs> He knows me and my addiction so well. So he brought home a pack of those, which is a colored acrylic mousse. Um, again, it's a very, very light weight, very creamy texture paste, which I love. It came in a set of those um, four pretty pastel colors, which I really love, especially with um, spring. <laughs> just around the corner well Christmas is just over and well whenever Christmas is just over I feel like I'm ready for spring <laughs> I could start getting Christmassy in I don't know in September already <laughs> but once Christmas is over the beginning of January I'm already for spring I'm already buying the first tulips <laughs> so anyways it's a pretty creamy uh, lightweight texture paste and yeah it actually looks like mousse I guess that's why they named it like that and I'm not sure if this is available international but in Germany actually Marabou is the first brand or not the first brand but it's a brand which came out with a lot of mixed media supplies lately which I really love <laughs> but um I don't know, I have my tried and true brands that I love to work with, uh, international brands. So I never gave those a try uh, up until now, but I gave them a shot and I really love them. As you can see, they're super, super creamy and they dry really, really uh, like soft, creamy. Love that. So it's not super grainy compared to some other uh, texture pastes. <laughs> Texture pastes is that so what they call texture paste? Anyways, <laughs> so I really love the texture of it and uh, love the result of it. Let me just uh, clean my hands. So um, yeah, and I just thought I would give them a shot, give them a go on this canvas here. I used the um, the texture paste, and there was another pack which I didn't try yet which comes with those four tubes here which is a white base primer and a black base primer so similar to gesso and then there is um, what is it one is I think this one is a collage glue yeah so similar to um, the uh, Mod Podge that I'm using so just a glue and then another one which is like a um, gel crystal gel medium so similar to the um, gel medium that I use um, basically and again I'm just like super happy that there are German brands kind of um, stepping into that mixed media sector branch whatever you want to call it I mean there are German brands uh, who have like mixed media supplies like Viva Decor for example but anyways um, really like them really I'm pretty happy with the result and the way they work and yeah I just want like to share the process of creating this cute little canvas board super easy super quick nothing big nothing fancy <laughs> again I just wanted to give those colors or those um, this paste to try and I also used it in the background to kind of rub it onto the canvas to color it similar to acrylic paint and I really love it it's very smooth very creamy so you can spread it out nicely and it gives you just a little bit of a rough texture in the background which I love and uh, it also has a, a perfect consistency for using with stencils because it's not like too heavy again too grainy um, but it it's thick enough to give you a really nice raised 
print um, of the stencil. So yeah, I really love them, like them, and I think we will jump right in and get started and you can watch me create this if you like, <laughs> if you want to. And if you are in Germany, um, they are also available like in craft stores. But right now, <laughs> those are available at Lidl. Lidl? Lidl lohnt sich. Um, so you might be able to grab some in your local Lidl supermarket. Um, if you are quick, if you are fast. <laughs> because I think they came out on Monday. And our supermarket uh, had some left. Uh, so yeah, give it a shot. Otherwise than that, you can... Just order them online somewhere on a craft supply store. Anyways, okay guys, let's jump right in and get started. Hope you will enjoy the process.